guys, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel, or if you're new, hi, my name is Carissa. I hope you're all doing really well. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please make sure you hit that little button down below and that you are. For today's video, I'm bringing at you an aloe yoga haul. I actually did one a few months back, and that was kind of like my official introduction into the brand. And honestly, since then, I've been so obsessed with them. I've kind of found like a new love for them. So that's why I'm so excited to be filming this video and to be doing another haul for you guys. This one is more focused on summer outfits. So it's definitely full of like biker shorts and sports bras. I really think that you guys are gonna enjoy this video. So I'm not gonna waste any more time and let's just go ahead and get into the haul. So starting with sports bras, this is the first sports bra that I wanted to share with you guys. It is called the Vapor Leopard Bra. So I don't know if you can see it, but very close up, it does have a leopard print. It's kind of like a white and a gray color. This sports bra is so sleek. It's like the softest material. It is dry wicking and it does provide like a nice four way stretch in it too. This does not have any padding in it whatsoever. So just a heads up with that. It doesn't even have like any slots if you wanted to provide like your own inserts in it. So that's kind of annoying especially for those that do like to have padding in their sports bras. This I got in a size extra small only because again the issue that I have with a lot of like sports bras the band size fits me in a size extra small and if I was to size up to a small then the band size would just be way too big. I actually think that this one fits quite well but I feel like I could be toppling out from it and I don't feel like it's a high impactful sports bra so definitely Ali Yoga I feel like it's in their name a lot of their clothing is designed for yoga, Pilates, and that sort of thing. So I feel like this kind of falls under that sort of category, but definitely for like potentially running errands or running around, this would be a good sports bra for that. I ended up picking up the exact same sports bra in this like snake print. So this doesn't have a name on it. I'm sure it's pretty similar to the other one, like Vapor snake print bra maybe I don't know but this is in the exact same size and the size extra small it's in their bone print I was so excited when I saw this online I just thought it was so unique and I don't have like a lot of prints so I was definitely very excited to pick this one up I will say that the fit on this one is kind of different than the leopard one I just showed I do feel like the bra kind of flattens my chest a bit but honestly, if you guys are a cup size smaller than me, this is gonna be such a perfect sports bra for you. It's so comfortable, it's so soft, like I was saying, and sleek. And I just love the simplicity of it, of it being just kind of like a scoop neck in the back and no extra like crisscross details or anything like that. And then the nice simple scoop neck in the front too. And then they spice it up with their prints and stuff. So really cool about like these is that they do have matching leggings, matching bike pants, stuff like that. I feel like aloe yoga is really cool about that is that they always have like a matching set so this next sports bra is the whole reason why i placed my order to begin with i saw this style and i immediately needed to have it i was like oh my god that's gonna be such a go-to top for me not only for like working out but i feel like just for styling more casual outfits oh this is gonna be such a good one and it did not disappoint at all this is called the wellness bra i got it in a size extra small this color is called strawberry it's such a perfect color again i don't feel like i typically go for colors i stick like more with the neutral family and so this was a big shock to me that i even picked this one up but i'm so happy i did i love this color i feel like it looks really flattering on my skin tone and it's just kind of like the perfect color for summer too, you know? But more about this top in particular is that it is like rib detailing as you can see throughout. I love like the thick bands everywhere and on the bottom too. It has such great support. It keeps me nice and snug, but comfortable. It does have padding in it, but it is removable, which is really great. The material of this is not cotton. I think it's more like a polyester spandex mixture. I don't know how this is gonna hold up with like working out for instance, and it's probably gonna show sweat. I don't know, I haven't put it to the test yet, but for sure, like just wearing it casually, I could not be more excited for this. You guys already know where I'm headed since I thought I was gonna be so obsessed with that top. 
I felt like I needed it in every single color. So I actually picked it up in black as well. I think that black is such a staple color. It's just a classic. Same rib detailing. I got the same size, same everything. I forgot to mention the very back does have the aloe logo on there. Removable padding is in this one as well. And then I also picked it up in the white one too. God, I had to have black and white classic colors and then throw in like a colorful one too. So such an easy to wear like silhouette on it. I will say like with the white one, I'd be nervous taking out the padding cause I think it might be a little see-through. So I might leave the padding in on the white one, but otherwise I think it looks good without the padding or with the padding. And again, I picked these all up in a size extra small and that fits absolutely perfect. I think that it does run like a tad big, so I would definitely size down in these. But given, again, my cup size on them, I think that this size is absolutely perfect for me and it's still tight enough around like the band, you know? But it has plenty of coverage in the cup, so that's why I think I recommend sizing down in these wellness bras. So I saw this t-shirt on their website and it just screamed Carissa, so I of course had to pick it up. What I love about it is that it has just like a nice like flowy feel to it. It's not tight, it's just like loose and relaxed, you know? But it does have a little elastic band on the bottom of it, so it like it cinches in around your waist a little bit more. I absolutely love that fit. The sleeves are long and it has like thicker cuffs on them too. But what is great about it too is that it does have like a mock neck on it. I feel like this is gonna be such a great top to transition into fall with and it's gonna be just such a staple because again, it's just white. It is slightly see-through, so just make sure you're wearing like a nude bra or a nude sports bra or something under it if you didn't want it to show through. This is called the Kick It Crop Tee and I got it in a size extra small. Okay, no particular order here. I have four pairs of like biker type shorts to share with you. So the first being these ones right here. It's in like a white gray camo. So freaking cute. <laughs> this one doesn't have any details on the tag, but I do remember that this is the vapor fabric. So similar to those first two sports bras that I showed you that like super sleek soft material of it i don't feel like this would snag or anything so i definitely love like the feel of these against my skin a lot i just ran to get a measuring tape really fast because i wanted to measure the inseam on these because that's something that kind of bothered me about their website is that on all their bike shorts they didn't mention the inseam and for me being petite the inseam is very important i can't have shorts that are too long because it just looks funny so i just measured these and this is a six and a half inch inseam so definitely like within the range of something that i I feel looks good on my height and my body type you know these are definitely very stretchy the back of them has just like a straight cross line like above the butt you know the seam right there I ended up picking these up in a size extra extra small I will say for some reason on these white camo pair even in a size extra extra small it's a bit too loose for me I would just like around like my butt in my uh, like upper thigh area just to be like a little bit tighter personally so just a heads up on that I just find that aloe yoga does run slightly big and it's kind of interesting that I had a size down to a size extra extra small and even that in this isn't like 100% to my liking, but it is fine and it does work, you know? So this next pair of shorts online looks so unique. It looks so great on the model and I just needed to get them and try them out. I was between the strawberry color and the white, but of course I went with white and more neutral. I think I should have got the strawberry to match like the strawberry sports bra. That would have been so freaking cute. This pair of short is called the high waist circuit short. So what's really cool about, as you can see, is that it is like, it has kind of like two shorts. So it has a like biker short, you know, spandex short underneath it, but it also has a flowy short over top of it. So the white over top of it, it is see-through. It's like a, a waterproof woven fabric, which is really cool. And then the bottom is just like, you know, a bike short. So it's really tight on. On the right hand side, it does have like a small little mesh pocket on the inside, like underneath the first layer of shorts, I guess. But yeah, these are high-waisted. I did get these in a size extra, extra small and they fit so comfortable. This fabric is definitely a lot thicker than the last pair I just showed and the inseam on these are the exact same. So this black pair is the next pair of bike short that I wanted to show you guys. So it is just like a nice simple black pair. It is called their high waist biker shorts. It is their airbrush fabric and it is very sweat wicking. It has four way stretch to it. So what's good about it is that it still has like the performance aspect but this is definitely something that you can pair with your casual 
street style, you know? This is about the same length and inseam. It's just like just shy of six and a half. So it's kind of like between the six and 6.5 inch inseam on them. These are pretty much identical to the white ones that I just shared with you where the fabric is a lot thicker on them. I feel like this fabric is very comparable to the Ritzia biker shorts that I've shown you guys and that I'm just so obsessed with. I think it's the, I always get it backwards, but I think it's the Equator bike short from Aritzia. The fabric feels pretty much identical. This I got in a size extra, extra small, and this definitely feels snug and it just, it's so comfortable to wear and I love this pair so much. It's like tight in all of the right places, you know? You already know when I saw the sports bra in this fabric that I had to get the matching set to just show you guys what the matching set looks like. So I ended up picking up the snakeskin print in the bike shorts. I think they just call this bone though. This I did get in a size extra extra small as well, but it has the exact same material as the white camouflage ones that I showed you. It is that vapor fabric, so it's very soft and lightweight and kind of has like a silky type of feel to them. These I will say are a lot tighter on me than the white camouflage. Not exactly sure why that is a bit inconsistent, but I like the fit of these a little bit more than the white camouflage, at least on me. This has a six inch inseam and I'm just so obsessed with this pattern. I think it's so cute and so on point and obviously with the matching set, it would look great, but I think it honestly, I think it would look really good with like a black sports bra. And do we dare with the strawberry as well? I think that that's a little loud, but I think it would look so cute paired together. These are not see-through at all, and they're just very, very comfortable. All right, that wraps up the haul. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Everything I mentioned will be linked down in the description in detail, along with like my sizing information for reference for you guys too. But should you guys have any questions, just let me know. I'm always happy to help. Also, I would be curious if there's any like specific videos that you guys want me to film. So definitely let me know that down below too. Please like this video and please subscribe before you go. And I will see you in a couple days in my next one. Bye guys, love you.